In Oyo State, Governor Sheyi Makinde has commended teachers for their dedication and support to the incumbent administration, especially in the battle to contain the dreaded COVID-19 pandemic. In a statement on Monday, the Oyo State Commissioner for Education, Science and Technology, Barista Olasukomi Olale, saluted Oyo teachers for being partners in the drive to promote qualitative education in the state. He urged them to persevere in driving or your state to academic excellence. We're now being joined by Angela Ajala, Executive Director, Ladella Schools, Abuja, to discuss World Teachers Day. Thank you very much, Mrs. Ajala, for joining us. Thank you. And thank you for having me. Fantastic. First of all, do you think Nigeria teachers have reasons uh, to celebrate today as World Teachers Day? Well, under the circumstances of the pandemic, I think everybody has reasons to celebrate. But if we're to look at it in terms of tangible and physical specific um, gifts or, or just basic needs of life, I don't think there's much to celebrate. Hmm. And now the president uh, says he has approved a special salary for teachers. Do you see this as what teachers should rejoice over, knowing fully well that similar promises have been made before regarding teachers' welfare? Well, it's a step in the right direction. That was very kind and generous of the president to institute a special salary scale. And we hope that that will be instituted and bureaucracy will not affect it. One of the basic laws of Maslow, the lowest is the physiological needs. And those physiological needs, they need money for you to achieve them. So that is a step in the right direction. And we thank Mr. President for that. Mm. One of the president's other announcements was that he has increased the number of service years from 35 to 40, you know, so, but don't you think the government should be looking at, uh, uh, you know, pension and retirement benefits for teachers rather than an extension of, of their years in service? Because, I mean, this is what people have been saying. What do you think? Well, um, the retirement is because, you know, teachers are working with children and you will be amazed that a teacher at 60 or 70 is still very agile, very competent, very knowledgeable. And the amount of resource and knowledge, if you retire them too early, you miss out on what they can give the younger generation. I even expect professors and co to retire at 70, 80, because what they carry, before you are able to groom people to that level, it's important to take note of all that and use all their knowledge for the benefit of the society. So I think it's a good one. It is a good one. I think there's a pension scheme in place. There is a pension scheme in place approved by government. And so extending this makes it possible for teachers to be active in their industry for as long as they can. Thank you very much for your kind thoughts, Mrs. Ajala. Thank you very much. You're welcome.